The solar plexus chakra governs our digestion. It governs our willpower, um, how we stay committed to something. Um, do we have the determination, the perseverance to stay with what we had anticipated and work through the ups and downs and learning how to digest that so that we can have the outcome or the lessons that are associated with that. But it's, it's about moving forward and staying on your path. So when a solar plexus chakra is in balance, when we show up to life, we have more of a, um, a constitution that is, you know what, I can do this. There's a belief system. Even though there might be challenges to moving forward, we have the will and the desire and the perseverance to say, you know what, I have the strength to move through this. I know I can overcome these obstacles. I know that I can stay on path because I'm balanced and I'm strong and you know, such is life, but I'm gonna keep moving forward. So what's really good to use for the solar plexus is um, the yellow stones. And, and there's no right or wrong as to what stones can be used, but it really comes down to you feeling what is right for you. So citrines are amazing. Um, the agates that have the yellow colors, the jaspers that have the yellows, the pyrite is another. It has that gold infusion of, of the sun and of light. Um, I know that we use some of the Himalayan quartz crystals, but it's anything that's infusing that element of the sun, the element of the energy of light. You know, I believe that all of the chakras have such, something to teach us and something to heal. I believe the third chakra um, is about what do I need to do um, to nurture myself, to invest in myself, um, to do and live my passion from a willful place.